Big pimpin', baby. What's up, everybody? It's your boy K Ray. Back at you today. Today, I just want to go over a few things. I made a couple modifications to my little backyard smoker. It's a Brinkman uh, Trailblazer uh, Limited, I mean, Trail Master, sorry, uh, Limited Edition. Um, what I did, I just added some, uh, some tuning plates uh, to it. And what I'm doing now is just pretty much uh, getting it tuned up. To the way I like to cook, um, put a little of this um, high temp silicone on there to cover up a, a, a couple leakage spots that I had in the doors. So right now, everything is looking pretty good. Um, should be ready to, to do cook on it pretty soon. Actually, later on today, that's what I think I'm going to do. We I mean, like this. Right now, I got this uh, thermometer here. It's like all the way toward the stack. It's reading like about 248, but it's a little, it's about 10 degrees off, you know, it's 10 degrees low. So, really, it's about at 237 right now, which is pretty cool because I can cook you know my briskets and my butts on this side if I want to um, I, uh, you know I, I won't be doing big cooks on this but just in case I want to do a medium sized cook or or something like that I have uh, the versatility with the with this pit now to do that gauge here is holding like at 245 so really it's the same temp it's, it's, it's this one on this side right here. Let's open up and see what we got. They're going to gauge in the middle. It's holding like at 275, which is good because I could, um, you know, cook my ribs and everything right there in the middle. The one closer to the firebox is like at 300, which is fine for me. The way I cook, I can cook my chicken um, over here. So, chicken and sausage. So it's kind of like set up how I want it. I mean, like on this side, man, it used to get up to close to 400, 500 degrees easy right by the firebox. So the way I got the tuning place laid out, I got still got my water pan over there so I can keep moisture in here. And I just got like three plates right here. And I got another plate um, coming up, acting as a baffle. And right now, it's, it's, it's working out pretty good. I mean, I didn't have to, you know, drill anything, cut anything. I just laid them out on the bottom rack. Uh, that was in here for for charcoal, to hold charcoals in. I mean, I'm never going to do any uh, charcoal on, on this, you know. I just do all, all smoking on it. And uh, I just slanted this one, got it a little bit longer than the other ones. And... Uh, and it, it works as a baffle really good. So I just laid them in now and it works. It's working fine for me now. Five box is like really efficient now. I mean, if you look, no big fires. Damper is almost all the way closed and it's holding really, really good temp. That's exactly what I'm looking for. So that just give you some ideas. I mean, if you can look now, like, I don't know if you can see it, but like where the big baffle was at, the, the heat is just going up under the bottom of the tuning plates and coming out over the top. And that's good, that's what I'm looking for. Burning nice and clean. And as far as the smoke goes, really thin blue smoke really thin blue smoke that's what I'm looking for that's how you get good smoke in your meat and get the good clean taste so eventually I start off with charcoals on here and eventually burn all wood right there you can see my little wood stack got me a half a quarter wood which is cool I don't have to be running back and forth to the store all the time now I got that 
Then I just got me a little miter saw and a stand, work stand, and I cut my wood into the sizes that um, that's that's preferable for me. So, and those are like the little mini logs that I have that I use right there. So, you know, this is what I've been doing today. If it's helpful to you, um, that'll be good. Um, so, you know, you can get some out of these little, um, you know, backyard pits, two, three hundred dollar pits where they can cook are uh, pretty efficient. And the silicone that I put around the doors, you can see, like now I don't have any leaks coming out of there, man. I used to have smoke like just hovering out of there, like big time. So, I worked out pretty good for me. That's about it. I'll be back a little later. I think I'm going to do a cook on it later on today. All right. Everybody have a good one. Thank you.